So it's two wingers with one game of MLR experience between them today for Utah on the sides in the wings, looking at Jesse Hamilton and Sione Mahe for their franchise. So the pace slows a little bit here. Chicago, though, still knocking on the door here in the opening couple of minutes of this match. Outside near the touchline, good offload to the line, and Chicago gets it in and gets it down. And the Hounds, guess who? Dominguez. Short little run there. Going, spinning it free, back to Joel Hodgson. Hodgson kick outside, beautiful ball, right into the hands of the runner, and an offload there for the Warriors. Here they come now, working their way down the pitch, and what a play. Wilson puts it into the hands. I got it, I got it. I got it. Trying to put his side up here by three. That tough conversion kick he made from the far side touchline. Kick is on the way, and this is an absolute banger. That one's good, and it's 10-7 Chicago. Well, here it is now. That is, this is a wonderful bit of skill. I said about Joel feeding his uh, backs out on the width. Do that by passing, do that by kicking. It's a wonderful offload there by Mahi and Bailey Wilson. I'm so pleased to see him back in this starting team, the captain. He is such a powerful runner. And he just swats off Lucas Rumble. Oh, he will hate yeah. to see that, Lucas. <laughs> and that is a fine try. I still think we're waiting to hear some stuff Thank from you. the referee. Here they go from that. Line out, quickly move it. There he is with the ball to CK. Came from the back there, good speed coming in from Chicago. Now the Warriors toward the line, inside of the five, and they get down to the try zone and get it in, and they put it down. Utah gets the lead here, the five-pointer. Here's a crowd into it, close to a sellout at Zion's Bank Stadium in Harriman. Out the back they go. There's Mockney. They got speed. Here comes Lasique. Lasique gives the ball. A big pickup here. Inside of the 22 they go. That was Mahe again. He's got speed to burn back there. Getting in there to the back. Get it free. Couple of meters away are the Hounds. Trying to get the lead back here. They power toward the line again and they get it down. And Chicago. Off the miscue. And they continue the push. They're a couple of meters away. Chicago again trying to hold the line and hold them up. The push continues. Still in there. And the Warriors able to get it down. They put it away. I don't know how you fly house feel when broadcasters say this is a chip shot. But this essentially is a chip shot, right? And the flags go up, you, and it's good. You can say it now, Beth, when the flags go up. But trust me, there is no such thing as an easy... Wow, I don't know. That is pretty easy kick. Utah looking to get their record level at one and one. Trying to seal this match here. McClay got to it. Now Hodgson with a break. Joel Hodgson still with it. Hodgson on the move. Hamilton's got it. And Hamilton is going to dot it down. Exclamation point. Utah Warriors. And he's got the finish necessary as he took that in as Hodgson. This one, because of that wind, nowhere near it. It's 29-15. And Utah wins the match. The Warriors... Get the job done, Paul Lasique, he's got a handshake.